Hello, Swatty Cap. So I'm looking a bit sweaty. I've just come back from the shop and uh, the aircon's not on in here. But I just thought I'd show you the room. Excuse the the, uh, the mess uh, of the bed. Um, but obviously I used the, the room last night. But look, for 650 baht, brand spanking new. Um, the hot shower could do with being a bit hotter if you were like hot showers in the hot country. But trust me, you should really be having cold showers in a hot country because they're a lot better for you. But it's a beautiful place. Brand spanking new. So let's uh, just quickly show you out the front. So obviously you can see I'm on the ground floor here. And there we go. Muddle garden. The sun's probably gonna main road across there and the bus station for Yasson is literally two minutes walk. My camera probably won't pick it up because it's a little bit too far. Oh, a bit. But anyway, it's, it's, it's over yonder. It's literally just over the road, opposite. Uh, but there you go. I don't know how, how many rooms. I'd say quite a few, looking at the size of the place. And there's a lovely little uh, reception area. If you're interested in um, cameras, there's a, through the ages of cameras, there's, they're not really that old as such, but have a look. roll cameras going right up to digital and on this side we've got model toys I suppose and on this side we've got a little seating area where you can help yourself to coffee and I think hot chocolate and obviously there's a, a drinks fridge there you can buy drink soft drinks yeah, fantastic. Doesn't appear to be a lift. So, cool though, isn't it? Really cool. <laughs> Do you have a lift? A lift or just stairs? No lift. No lift, okay. So no lift. So if you're disabled, probably have to have Make sure you get in in advance and try and get one of these rooms down on the on the ground floor. There is a ramp, so obviously you can get wheelchair in. But yeah, lovely little spot, the room and the bed. Oh my god, the bed has to be, and and the, the bedding in itself as well actually have to be. Like I say the best that I've had so far. Since being in Thailand, it is like, not like like super 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 soft. It's actually like a one of these um, oh, what are they call memory foam jobbies. So it is absolutely perfect. But there you go, six hundred and fifty baht a night, and obviously you got the little uh, balcony area outside to have a cigarette or. Sit in the sun. The sun on on, on this side of the, the room in, first thing in the morning. So, if you like sitting out first thing in the morning, it's ideal. But anyway, just thought I'd share that with you all. Lovely spot, uh, Yasathon. Um, so, if you're heading towards Mahakbahan um, to do your border crossing um, and you don't make it in time, or not looking to make it in time, um, because obviously the border closes at 10 o'clock and I wasn't going to make it last night, so I stopped here. Um, and I'm glad I did. That's all I'm saying, I'm glad I did. And I will be back once I get my visa issues back in hand. So anyway, I um, have to leave Thailand today. Um, my visa's expired and I should have left yesterday, so it's going to be 500 baht overstay fine for one day. Um, I just hope I don't get a black mark against my name for, for not leaving on time. But I'm sure they'll understand when I tell them it was my son's birthday yesterday. But anyway, love you all and leave you. Um, and look forward to the next adventure, which will be in Laos. Yeah.
So uh, leaving Thailand, and um, not sure when I'll be able to get back here, if at all. So yeah, wish me luck on my forward travels. See you all in the next one. Ta-ta for now.